Hello guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Spectre and I specialize in Among Us mods and gameplays. Today we have a new Among Us mod called the Cultist mod which adds a whole new faction to the game. It engages crewmates and allows for multiple or certain multiple mods to work with it. I haven't tested which mods work with it right now but I'd imagine some of the other role mods will work with it uh, in combination. So basically uh, how the the cultist works is the cultist leader has to convert crewmates into his cult. If there are more cultists than um, half the players alive, then the cultists will win. So, for example, if there are five players alive and three of them are cultists, the cultist will win. So, what's going to happen is the cultist leader will convert the cult and the imposters are still trying to kill everybody. So it's going to be crewmates versus cultists versus imposters. So it adds a whole new third faction. So what's going to happen here is uh, there are a ton of settings to mess with for your group. So I'll just go over them right here. Uh, so enable cultist is just enabling the mod. Uh, crewmates win on imposter death, uh, so this should be true because, um, well, it's it makes the most sense because the crewmates are fighting against the imposters, not technically the cults. So if the game continues, then the cultists would basically uh, just win, um, or the crewmates would have to win by completing their tasks and voting all the cultists out. So this is a little bit uh, makes sense to keep it on, in my opinion. Um, so you can't convert imposters to your cult, which is important. You can only convert crewmates. So this is kind of cool, a uh, cool setting that it will still take up one of your charges. So you can find out who the imposter is as a cultist. So it's kind of cool that you can kind of vote them out or play on their side for a little while if you need some more time to convert the right amount of people. Um, it kind of makes it the game super easy if you know who's already been converted to the cult. So this is default off, but basically the cultists would just know who's already in the cult, basically, because the names would be purple. Um, so this is kind of cool. If the cultist leader dies, then the cult uh, can't recruit any more numbers. Uh, so if this is enabled, then the cult can uh, recruit more members because the cultist role will be transferred on to another person. Uh, so this is the max amount of conversion. Oh, so this prevents people from winning. Like immediately they can't convert five people out of the 10 people and instantly win. So they can make three. So they have to kill off some people in the end or vote some people out. And yeah, this is just the cooldown, just like the kill cooldown, similar type of thing. And the cultist vision will be lower than regular crewmates vision. So it's applied onto the crewmate vision and made lower via that. So we're going to go through the installation for how to do this. So the first step is to go to cultist mod 1.0.0. You're going to download the zip. <laughs> Click keep. You're going to go to your Steam go to Among Us, right click, manage, browse local files. So it'll open up this nice folder with all your Among Us in it. You won't have this folder. This is here from a previous video. So it's a different mod, but I'm just going to go ahead and delete these. And then what I'm going to do is go into my downloads on here and I'm going to have cultist mod. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to unzip the files into this path right here. So I'm going to hit control C, copy the path over. Sorry. I'm going to hit control V to put that into there. Click extract and it will go ahead and extract everything I need into this among us folder. And there we go. So now it's installed. I'm going to click Among Us and it will open up for me. It might take a bit after the first installation to open up, but that's just how it is sometimes. It'll open up uh, 
quite quick after that. So it's just the first time that you open it and it might take a second because it's figuring out all the assets and how it should work. So it will open up. You just got to give it a second on some computers. Uh, my computer is a little bit slow, so I'm just giving it a second to load. And there we go. And there we go. So mods loaded three. This means it's installed correctly. And you'll see Cultus Mod 1.0.0 by Aeolic. So again, I did not make this mod. Big thanks to Aeolic for making this mod. This is his first mod that he has released. So I'm sure it will release a lot more. And this is super cool uh, and super polished for an Among Us mod. Uh, so I'm super happy to, uh, to promote him and uh, his GitHub and any other social medias that I find out about him will be in the description. So that being said, we're going to go into local, create game, and we're gonna take a look at these settings. So you can see they're on the bottom here. So all the settings are customizable in a game. So we can enable cultist on or off, Crewmates win on imposter death on or off. Imposter conversion attempts reduces con conversion. So that's like if you try to reduce an imposter, if it uses a charge or not, um, can be on or off. And then cultists know where the other uh, cultists are. And all these settings are fully customizable in a game, which is super cool. So that was it for the cultist mod installation. So what I do have to say is that he did say that it can take some finicking to get uh, a good settings in because there's a lot of settings to customize. So it depends on your group size and how your groups plays, uh, how OP the cultist role can be because it can be very OP or very underpowered. So you got to figure out those settings for yourselves. But the recommended settings are what's on default for a 10 player lobby. So I'd recommend trying that out first if you're going to do this with your group but it's definitely super cool to be able to try and uh, I would definitely uh, give this mod a go in my testing it was a lot of fun and uh, that's it for this video I'll see you guys in the next one make sure to leave a like and subscribe to the YouTube channel if you appreciate all these mods and tutorials and you want to see some gameplays in the future uh, Love you guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.